It's Wednesday, June 8th. I'm Erin Guy with your news to go. The family of an elderly man who died in a fire at an assisted living facility in West Palm Beach planning to file a lawsuit. It happened the morning of May 11th at Colonial Assisted Living that's on North Congress Avenue. Police say the fire broke out inside the room of 80 year old Andre Ballinger on the second floor. They say the medical staff tried to pull him out but were pushed back by heavy smoke. The lawyer for the family says an investigation found the death could have been prevented. We're expecting more details during a news conference. It happens at 3 o'clock today. One day after Democratic State Senator Annette Tadeo dropped out of the race for governor, her former opponent, Charlie Crist, endorsing her run for Congress. Congressman Crist released a statement saying in part, the people of Florida's 27th Congressional District deserve a leader in Congress who shares their values and beliefs and will fight for them tooth and nail. There are now two main candidates for the Democratic bid, Crist and Nikki Freed. Boynton Beach officials want to hear from you about their plan for city parks. The city's Recreation and Parks Department is holding several meetings to get feedback, including one tonight. You can weigh in on the direction, development, and delivery of the city's services for the next 10 years. The meeting is going to be at Boynton Beach Arts and Cultural Center. It starts at 630. And then another round of showers and thunderstorms will be developing west of the highways later in the afternoon hours. As we take a look at your seven day forecast, temperatures will be near 87 degrees today, 88 on your Thursday and Friday with those rain chances each afternoon until Sunday. Looking much better and drier on Monday and Tuesday with those hot temperatures in the low to mid 90s.